everyone. I'm Emma from The Journey. And I'm Darlene from GoDaddy's How To. Today, we're going to talk about adding product reviews to your e-commerce site. That's right, Darlene. People trust other people, especially when those who've done things that they want to do. Let's say you want to buy a new car or a new computer or even a great new hot sauce. <laughs> you may ask your friends or family or even a random social media page for recommendations. Having those recommendations make us feel good about our decisions to do business with an unfamiliar company, especially in a time of uncertainty where businesses are closing their doors and moving to an online model, maybe for the first time. Yeah, a visible review posted in the last few days could be the difference between a sale and your customer scrolling down to the next website. By showing the trust of your current customers, new customers are far more likely to check you out. Let me show you how to connect your Websites Plus Marketing e-commerce site to Yotpo so your customers can start to leave product reviews and ratings on your site. The starting point is our Websites Plus Marketing dashboard. From the header, choose Store and Overview. In the Track and Capture Sales section, click Enable Reviews. Connecting your online store to Yotpo lets you collect reviews with the Email After Purchase feature, stand out in search results by displaying your customer ratings, and your customer can share their reviews on social media. Let's turn on product reviews. In the Build and Trust with Product Reviews window, you can sign in with an existing account by clicking Connect or enter the email address where you want the reviews to be sent, then click Sign Up. I'm going to enter my email address, then click Sign Up. That's it. Now that Yotpo is enabled, you can click Manage Reviews to see your product reviews. If this is your first time using Yotpo, you'll see a Welcome to Yotpo page. Click Get Started. At this point, Yotpo has a video to teach you how to use their site. We recommend that you watch their video and then click Next so you can get familiar with the interface. I'm going to change gears and show you what this looks like on your site so you can see what your customers will see. First, we're going to publish the site. Let's go check it out. From the shop page, let's look at one of the products. I'm going to choose Larry's hot sauce. From the product page itself, there's an option for your customers to write a review. Let's try it. We'll give it some stars, enter a title, write a review, and enter our name and email. Don't worry, the email won't show on the final review. When things look good, click post. Once the review has been submitted, your customer can share the review on their own social media by clicking the share links. Now, when other customers visit your site and look at this product, they'll see the reviews left by other customers. It's a good practice to respond to your customer reviews, and you can do this by responding to the email that you receive when a review is actually submitted. Now, if the review is positive, you can thank your customer, right? And if the review is negative, that gives you a chance to make it right, gives you a chance to neutralize it. That's right, Emma, and it's so important to do that. It shows your potential customers that you'll do what you can to make things right if needed. Darlene, thanks for showing us how to add product reviews to our site. It was great to see you. You too, Emma. Stay safe and healthy.